Gotta debunk this, but I am going to say this out loud, I am not part of Gonamate community anymore, and I mean it, I am not joking, it's been a week since I permanently left the criteria and never coming back there ever again, nor am I ever rejoining the Goanimate community, the Vian community is extremely toxic over the past several months due to doxers, criminals, perverts, pedophiles, etc. Some of the users kept on bringing up other users' past and ruining their reputation, which is not okay. I left all Vian Discord servers, including GoAnimate City, but I'm staying on non-Vian and non-Vian related Discord servers. Listen, I redeemed myself for the past several months, and some of the users brought up my past when I already redeemed myself. I don't want to keep getting reminded by GoAnimate community ever again. Every time when someone tries to expose me or call me out on my cringy old rants I made from 2020 to 2021, this causes drama, like, I am not that kind of person like this anymore. Plus, I stopped using the disgusting terms in my rants after the end of season 5 of my rants, and that is in 2021, I was 16 at the time, and I was a minor at that time, and minors cannot be. Pedophiles, Brendan Barney stopped doing that in 2016, and he stopped using disgusting terms in his rants as the same age as me, and that's the reason why Vian sucks, plus, Vian style rants suck nowadays, I already explained it in my rant on season 8 episode 7, and that's another reason why Vian sucks, some of the users, such as Sean Sullivan, Abiath Flores Animations and Pappy Anime 2012, made CP out of preschool characters on grounded videos out of them, which however is child grooming, and which is why a lot of people started to hate grounded videos because of this. Another thought is that Kenny Animate has compared GoAnimate to South Park, when South Park is a show on Comedy Central intended for adult, while GoAnimate is an animated website that is intended for younger audiences. If a certain TV show or movie containing CP in them, then the TV show or movie would have gotten banned. Whatever happens in the past stays in the past. This should never be brought up ever again. I'm sorry, but I no longer do grounded videos on preschool show characters or make rants on preschool show rants anymore. Another thing is the Vian styled commentary videos, they are putting the word commentary in the wrong context, and according to Google, commentary means an expression of opinions or offering of explanations about an event or situation. On top of that, Foxy the Fox 110 is most notable for spamming this kind of content. Punishment days is another reason why grounded videos suck nowadays, it's just a parent giving their child a number of punishments, and that is complete. Child abuse, and child abuse is a bad thing that makes life worst, callouts and exposing videos are another thing, that these kinds of videos causes drama non-stop, they try to brainwash on a user you hate. There's been a bunch of repetitive grounded videos, such as behavior card day videos, dead meets videos, grounded for nothing videos, bringing in an NC-17 rated movie to school, wearing a bad behavior alarm to school, getting sent to a random country, getting executed, etc. I did premiere all of my season 3 to 7 rants and salutes during my school hours, and some of them were heavily rushed that I didn't have time to finish them, and lastly, doxing, seriously, it's illegal to dox someone's personal information, and you can get arrested for doing that. I am keeping my channel 100% drama free, no drama, no bad stuff, so, anyway, that's all I have to say. I hope you guys understand this clearly now, and that you'll accept me for starting fresh on my YT channel. If I forgot anything, comment down below, anyways guys, see you later.